Hey guys and welcome back to another video. This video is just going to be a quick update on the most recent patch news for Star Wars Battlefront 2. If you guys are new to the channel, thanks for tuning in and be sure to subscribe down below for future Star Wars videos and to also be entered in my Star Wars t-shirt giveaway, the link for which will be down in the description. Now recently in the forums for Star Wars Battlefront 2, developer Sledgehammer70 dropped a post discussing what will be adjusted in the upcoming patch and when it will likely take place. And it all sounds like things that definitely need fixing. His post on the forums read, On Tuesday the 16th of January, Star Wars Battlefront 2 patch 1.1 will go live across all regions and platforms. This update is both a client and server update. We expect roughly 30 to 45 minutes of downtime per platform as the update rolls out across servers. January 16th, 2018 schedule patch, PC 8pm UTC, PS4 9 UTC and Xbox One 10 UTC. So obviously an hour in between each platform. It also said patch notes will be posted once the update is verified live. We thank you ahead of your time for your patience. Now obviously as he mentioned we won't have the patch notes until the update is live but several things that are being changed have already been confirmed by devs on Twitter. Here's what will be adjusted in the patch as a small peek at what you should expect. Some hero tweaks will be made and although there is no official word on who is getting tweaked, I feel like the main one we have to address is Chewbacca. He is way too overpowered in Heroes vs villains so that definitely needs to be changed and possibly also Palpatine as people have really been racking up ridiculous kill streaks with him and ever since his lightning got adjusted to do more damage he's just destroying everyone. The next thing to be addressed in the patch is the Wookiee Warriors and we all know how desperately they need a nerf. The Wookiee Warriors are stupidly overpowered and have the ability to take down heroes with full health, enemy ships, and just cause a massive problem for the opposing team, which is definitely frustrating if you save up your battle points for a hero, only to be killed in seconds by a group of Wookiees. Also getting looked at are some trooper tweaks for specialist, heavy, and officer. Now I'm not sure what these tweaks could be, and weapon tweaks are in a separate category for the patch, so possibly something to do with their star cards or health. I will confirm this once the patch notes are out. Moving on to weapon tweaks is something that has been largely in discussion around the community, specifically the Blurg for the officer class. This weapon is way too overpowered with the attachments it has available and the damage output will definitely be changed. Word is also that the CR2 for the assault class could be getting tweaked as well, but I think the weapon is fine the way it is already, so hopefully they don't change it too much. And lastly, general bug fixes are listed to be fixed. Now the main thing to be addressed is the lag issues. I know on PS4 I've been experiencing some lag and I've heard of other players on PC and Xbox complaining as well. So basically that says in itself that it needs to be fixed in the patch. The post did also say a lot more would be coming in the patch so hopefully some other good bits and pieces are thrown in as well. Like I mentioned earlier I will have full patch notes once the update goes live so be sure to turn on notifications to be alerted later today when I post that video. By the time this video goes up guys the patch should almost be live or be getting ready to go live so hopefully that's done when this video is live as well. As always guys if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and comment down below what you think needs a nerf in the next patch and if you aren't subscribed already be sure to do so to enter my giveaway. Thanks so much for watching and may the force be with you.